Welcome to my house. Please, enter of your own free will and bring with you some of the happiness that is so evident in your face and so lacking in my own. Oh, he's not getting there. Okay, I'll just cross this threshold here. Hmm, I'm sure if that's of some significance. I don't think what it is. Anyway, <laughs> I fair do. What? Nothing. So, I uh, seldom have visitors in these parts. Uh, what being out here in the middle of nowhere? On such a cold and gloomy night. Pray, follow me. You look as if you're in need of sustenance. And I have many things to eat and drink. Pray, follow. Oh, okay. Food, yeah. Hey, can I be sick of chocolate anyway? This way. As you can see, the house is in some sort of state of repair. We're having a few refurbishments doing at the moment, and I was planning to have all this not true, to make one big, uh, but anyway, well, I think so we'll just take the conservatory for the present. Ah, in my dining room. <laughs> More wine? I don't mind if I do, thank you. You're not drinking then? No. I never drink wine. <laughs> so, um, um, Who's this guy here? He looks, uh, he looks like you. Mm. My, uh, forefather. He was a crusader in a war of long ago. Went with the allies, with the squirrels and the panthers. That union, alas, was not successful. Yeah, and he had really stupid teeth as well. Didn't they have any dentists back then? Yeah. Who are you to criticize me or my ancestors, whose blood runs into these veins? You are not of noble birth, and never will be. <sighs> Pray accept my apologies. Whenever you talk about my ancestors, I get uh, somewhat touchy. Oh, that's all right. I know how it is, family. <laughs> yeah. So, um, you been here long? Mm. About 300 years. Really? <laughs> it's quite a big family, then. No, it's just me. Oh. What's that noise? Ah, the children of the night. What sweet music they make. Music? The howling. 
What is that noise? Sounds like somebody's braying on the door. <laughs> they don't like you either, I take it. Oh, shit. The villagers again. Sounds like there is more of them this time. This could be your lucky night, Conker. I was going to kill you and drink your blood. But now I think I'm needing your help. Trey, come here. Um, uh, can we just go back a bit there? That drinking my blood bit? What's all that about? I said, come here. And familiar, yes. I think you are my great, 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 great grandson, Conker. Welcome to the family. <laughs> Welcome indeed. I have a little task for you. These little uh, villagers. Occasionally pop up to my establishment for have a little fun and see if they can kill me. It's never worked yet. As you can see, I've had a few minor alterations to the house. They have the grinder. <laughs> and they have the pumps. And they have some other bits and pieces. It is your duty, your and indeed, the whole point of your existence as of this day is to fetch me the villagers, put them in the grinder, and let me feed. You may feed too if you wish, but only later. Well? Oh yes, I forgot. You can only speak like what you are. A bat. <laughs> Fetch, chop, chop. Fetch me the villagers. I am hungry. Thank <laughs> you. 
Every day. <laughs> oh. <sighs> ah, more zombies. Time for the double barrel boy. Hopefully, for the last time. 